What's up YouTube, Silver Dragons here. In this video, I'm gonna be doing a review of this beautiful piece of silver right here. It is the Oak Leaf. Thank you so much for watching my video. I sincerely appreciate it. This is gonna be a round review on this oak leaf piece of silver. It's not a silver coin, it's actually a silver round. We'll get to that in a second. But you can see up here it says oak leaf and then it is uh, one ounce of four nines fine silver and it has an oak leaf on it. Really, really beautiful. There is one acorn down here at the bottom. Uh, this is from the Germania Mint. I'll show you the other side here. So we got Germania up on top, and this is uh, the two-headed eagle with uh, the lightning bolts that it's holding. Really, really cool. Uh, 2019, and it does say five marks, but uh, there, there actually isn't a country. Germania isn't a country, and they don't use the mark. Uh, so this is just sort of for fun that they put that on there. But this is a round, not a coin. Uh, really, really beautiful. I love the stuff that the Germania Mint is putting out. I do want to say a massive thank you so much to them for sending it to me for a review. Um, I think they're still on pre-order right now. I know you could have gotten them on Atmex. I think they might be sold out at the moment. But uh, let's see, Monument Precious Metals or Monument Metals should still have some in stock on pre-sale. So definitely check them out if you want to pick one up for yourself. But here's the COA right here. Uh, take a quick peek at it. So the uh, Germania Mint, and uh, it's got some info right there. Of course, it's a BU, and okay, limited mintage. Let's look at the specifications. So face value, five marks, uh, but you know, it's still round, not a coin. Uh, 2019, four nines fine. Uh, looks like 38.61 millimeters, so this would probably fit nicely in a 38 millimeter capsule. Uh, let's see, one ounce BU, and it is limited to 50,000 pieces. So I don't think that they're doing the oak leaf in any other sizes. At least I haven't seen any being offered. Um, the allegories were offered in one ounce and two ounce and five ounce. But from what I've seen, you can only get the oak leaf in the one ounce version. So uh, if anyone knows more information about that, uh, you can correct me in the comments down below. But as far as I'm aware, these are only offered in one ounce. They are really, really cool. I don't know if they're going to do a whole series on plants and stuff like that. I think this just might be a one off. I haven't seen anything in the works for a series from them. Uh, but, you know, doing some research on Germania and oak leaves and whatnot, um, and also what I read off their website, it sounds like the Germanic people actually, like, really revered the oak trees. They thought this plant was sacred, it had gods living in it or something like that, and the acorns represented fertility. So uh, very cool. This would be a nice uh, piece to uh, purchase, just sort of uh, maybe for a collection or if you like the design um, or maybe even a good flip. I mean, it is limited to 50,000 mintage, which seems a little bit high. Um, so I don't know that the you'd be able to make a ton of money off this as a flip. Uh, but it is a very beautiful piece for sure. I do like the design. I like the leaf um, and how shiny it is. Really, really great detail. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. Check out the detail on that leaf. Just absolutely gorgeous. I really like that. You can see all the veins going through it there. Um, and then the pattern around it, beautiful as well. My eyes just keep going to the pattern behind the leaf. Uh, looking at all those sort of swirls or circles or whatever, it's really, really gorgeous. Now, the um, Germania Mint did send me a coin for review a little bit ago, the Allegories. And I wanted to pull it out here and show them sort of side by side. So you can see that they're doing a similar theme with their rounds. Um, well, these are actually both rounds. Uh, but check out the background behind the allegories. It's pretty much the same background as behind the leaf. I think that's really, really cool. This sort of has some consistency in the different pieces they're coming out with. And then around the uh, rim as well, you can see sort of that, uh, uh, I don't really even know what you call that, but interesting texture behind the uh, words. So, you know, you can just see it around the top here. Very, very cool. I haven't really seen anything else like that. Um, 
other than what the Germania Mint is putting out. So really, really interesting, fun pieces. I do like this oak leaf. I think it is very gorgeous. And I do like the little acorn down there at the bottom too. Uh, very, very cool. Um, and so if you're considering picking one up, I would say this is definitely a win. It's a, a beautiful piece for sure to add to your collection. Um, and then if we take one last look at the backside here, the Germania on the allegories, it had a completely different uh, side here on the back, but you can see that it does have the uh, two headed eagle there. So there is some consistency there as well. And uh, just really, really cool pieces. So anyway, uh, just a quick review here of the oak leaf that they sent me. Again, massive thanks to the Germania Mint. Um, it's really, really cool that they're sending these out to different members of the community um, to review. I've seen a couple other YouTubers uh, receive the rounds from them, and I think that's really awesome that they're doing that. They're kind of, you know, getting them out there in people's hands uh, before they're actually released. So you as a viewer can sort of get a look at it and decide if you like it. I really, really like the lightning bolts that the Eagle is holding. Uh, just absolutely gorgeous piece of silver. So anyway, thanks again to uh, Germania Mint. Really, really cool piece. That was the oak leaf and my review on it. Uh, again, it's a limited mintage of just 50,000. So something to consider if you're gonna pick one of these up for yourself. And I do really like this box that they sent it in as well. I don't know if they're gonna be sending them all out in these boxes. Uh, but really, really cool. That is a nice touch that they threw in there. So I do want to say a massive thank you so much to you, the viewer, for watching. And I'll see you all in my next one. Silver Dragons, out.